Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about multi-step inequalities, and we're going to solve each inequality and graph its solution. So if I was given this inequality, 28 minus 7x is less than or equal to a negative 4 times negative 7x minus 7. Okay? Well, my first step is I'm going to combine my like, or sorry, I can't combine my like terms. I'm going to distribute the negative 4. So we have 28 here minus 7x is less than or equal to negative 4 times a negative 7x is a positive 28x, because a negative times a negative is a positive, and negative 4 times negative 7, again, is a positive 28. Okay? So now we're going to bring our like terms together. Let's bring our x's to one side, our numbers to the other. It's really up to you. And this one here, I'm going to bring my x's to the right. So I'm going to add a 7x to both sides. And I'm going to subtract a 28 to both sides. And what that leaves me here is a 28 minus 28, which is 0, is less than or equal to 28 plus 7 is 35x, right? 28x plus 7x. So now we have uh, 0 is less than or equal to 35x. I'm going to divide both sides by 35. Give me, well, 0 divided by 35 is 0, so 0 is less than or equal to x right there. I'm going to rewrite this so x comes first, so we have, well, x going first here is greater than or equal to 0. Make sure you flip the inequality, if you, you know, flip, rearrange the whole equation or inequality having x going first. So now instead of 0 is less than or equal to x, we have x is greater than or equal to 0. And there we have it. So now we need to graph it. Pretty simple. Don't let the 0 uh, scare you. The zeros go by, I don't know, 5, so who cares, right? 5, 10, 15, negative 5, negative 10, negative 15. Okay? Well, since 0 is greater than or equal to, or x is greater than or equal to 0, we have a closed circle at 0 because it can equal 0, and our arrow goes to the right because x is also greater than that 0. So now our graph here matches our answer, which is x is greater than, greater than or equal to 0. So let's recap. We're given 28 minus 7x is less than or equal to negative 4 parentheses, negative 7x minus 7. I distribute the negative 4 across, giving me 28x here, right? Negative 4 times negative 7 is a, neg a positive 28x, and negative 4 times negative 7 is a positive 28. I then brought my like terms together, and this one I decided to add my 7x to both sides and subtract my 28 to both sides, eliminating these 7x's and this, these 28's. Well, 28 minus 28 is 0, and 28x plus 7x is 35x. Okay? So now I need to divide by 35 to both sides to get x by itself, and 0 divided by 35 is just 0. So we have 0 is less than or equal to x here. Fantastic, let's rearrange it, have x come first, and in doing so I have to flip the inequality. So now I have x is greater than or equal to 0. So I need to make my graph here. I have a closed circle at 0 because x can equal 0, and I put my arrow to the right because x is greater than 0. So now my graph matches my inequality, which is x is greater than or equal to 0.